and good morning to you. Good morning, everybody. Here's a look at what's trending. Breathe easy, Twitterverse. The tweet tiff between Taylor Swift and Nicki Minaj seems to be over. Thursday, Swift tweeted, I thought I was being called out. I missed the point. I misunderstood, then misspoke. I'm sorry, Nikki. Minaj replied, that means so much, Taylor. Thank you. It all began when Minaj expressed her disappointment that her hit Anaconda wasn't nominated for Video of the Year at the MTV Video Music Awards. Minaj says, there's a lack of recognition for minority artists. But the way Minaj worded her tweets, Swift took it personally and called out Minaj for pitting women against each other. Now, NASA wants the public's help coming up with new tools for its new robot assistant. The space agency has asked the crowdsourcing platform freelancers.com to help design tools the robot will use on the International Space Station. Robonaut 2, or R2, will have to perform tasks that require specific tools. NASA is hoping that Freelancer.com's 16 million users can help. They've designed a series of challenges that will roll out weekly. The winner of each challenge will receive between $50 and $100, and NASA gets to keep the intellectual property rights of the design. And more in NASA news, meet Earth's bigger, older cousin. That's what NASA is calling a newly discovered planet. Kepler-452b is 60% larger in diameter, but scientists say it's the first planet similar to the Earth's size. Its mass and composition aren't known yet, but previous research indicates its surface could be rocky. NASA says the discovery marks a milestone in the mission to find another planet like Earth and provides the opportunity to better understand the Earth's evolving environment. But just how far away is Kepler-452b? Well, it's 1,400 light years away from Earth in the constellation Cygnus. That's pretty far away, so we're not moving there just yet, I'm sure. So don't forget, we also want to hear from you. So make sure to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter and Instagram to join the conversation. And check out what's trending every morning right here on Good Morning Twin Tears.